mistaken, said John Ford. It's not a genre of which I've become bored. Stop bombarding me with suggestions for films to director and westerns. <laughs> The agreement between Noel and Liam Gallagher began on the way to Granada from Malaga. Finally, when Liam said Noel's voice lacked timbre, Noel punched him in the Alhambra. <coughs> Mahatma Gandhi had a distinctive modus operandi. Instead of trying to seize the enemy by the throat, he practice civil disobedience in a donkey. When Philip Glass asked what's wrong with the brass, they seemed to be playing my piece quite gingerly, he was told they were scared of repetitive strain injury. Hecate's vote arrest Sally Gunnell by means of spells and incantations used to funnel some of the magical energy by which Puck put girdles round about the earth into a 400 meter hurdles. <laughs> they only say I'm pretentious, said Debbie Harry, brandishing a copy of Hebrew Bois by Jarry. Out of jealousy, I'm the only one in Blondie who knows the difference between a chokey and a spondy? What a stupid question to ask, said Stephen Hawking. It must be the whiskey talking. Would my brief history of time have been briefer if they proved the existence of the ether? Does sheer height always look so uncommonly white? Or is it that induces some women to sport a prison pallet? She should write a report. <laughs> when morning Howard Hughes forgot to polish his shoes, and slowly this habit of self neglect grew so, he ended up looking like Robinson Crusoe. had an unusual muse. One of her odder features was an interest in the heads being torn off little creatures. <laughs> Beowulf is such a passion with Michael Jackson that he's even learned to speak Anglo-Saxon. One way he used to forget his troubles was to re it aloud to bubbles. <laughs> Irrational doubts plagued Carol King. People flocked to hear her sing. They'd clap and cheer away, but would they still love her the following day? Read questions carefully, it said in the paper on Kubrick, but foolishly I skipped that bit of the rubric. Then wrote for an hour on the gory in Paths of Glory, when all the examiners wanted was the story. <laughs> Martin Luther King was really into swing. After he'd been to the mountain top, he went off and had a quick lindy hop. When at a party Dr. Kinsey met sitting with her husbands a pair of conjoined twins he said scarcely believing his luck you must tell me how the four of you face life with such pluck. 